Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Fairy of Love. Welcome to your weekly horoscope. A lot of excitement this week. This week the sun is in Virgo entering Libra on Friday. Venus Day, Friday, with the fall equinox, where the dark of the night and the light of the days are equal. It's all about now integration and balance and harmony. The question is, is your personal scale in balance? Because now this is the week to really work on that and finish whatever you started this year until with the eclipse and the mercury retrograde to find out who you are what you want and how you could do better this week you finish that job to get that perfect harmony in your life for you people you love in the world make the right choices tuesday well we have a salty opposition between neptune planet of dreams and the sun the king of the heavens that could create a little confusion and forcing us to continue to reinvent ourselves even more profoundly we can't have illusions anymore who am i what do i want and how could i make my life a paradise and remember everyone it's never 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 too late and you're never too young too old or too tall or too slim or too whatever to be happy there's a moment it hits you and you do it so do it this Saturday, Mars, planet of energy, and Mercury, planet of communication, is very, very close in Virgo, increasing our mental energies, ability to focus, our desires to serve others. Remember everyone, we all are born to serve. Okay, some people more than others, but at the end of the day, that's the greatest joy of all, wouldn't you say? Because everything we gave it to ourselves. And also, this week, it's like, uh, and the epiphany of saying, mm, I love work. And that's also a time that if you're not happy at work, well, do something about it. On Tuesday, Venus, goddess of love, in flamboyant, loving Leo, enters down to earth and very purposeful Virgo. And it's sort of happening since last week. There's a whole new energy right there. So love becomes much more serious. It's much more about giving, sharing, but it's practical and grounded, which is good. And it's also looking for perfection, for, for what is your ideal and how could you just rekindle the flame in one way to make it more exciting. If not, well, change flame. Also, it's a good time to go to the gym, to invest in your beauty, to get any treatments that enhances your appearance, your health, your wellness. Venus in Virgo is absolutely fabulous for those things. If you are following a fast, a diet, you're doing a regimen to really, really make you yourself as healthy and beautiful as possible, wow, this is the week to start. Somehow also with Venus in Virgo, love is more useful than romantic. It's, a, it's sort of a, a practical romantic approach, okay? You weigh everything and you go, hmm. I think I'm gonna keep things this way or I'm gonna go there or there, but you're trying to get the balance. So on Wednesday, you have a new moon. Beautiful, beautiful new moon ready for the new in Virgo, also making us very practical, grounded, and in a way sentimental, but it's a balance between the mind and the heart. It's sort of uh, very pleasant. It's not too crazy. It's not too passionate where you throw yourself, you know, out the window and do all kinds of crazy stuff. You go like, whoa, whoa. I want to still get the joy, but I try to get it in a balanced way. Guess what? Singles can meet some really somebody special this week, even some soulmates from some of you. So if you're single looking for love, whoa, this new moon really helps you to maybe be at the right place at the right time to find the right partner. On Thursday, it's the UN International Day for Peace. Wow, that's my favorite day of the year. So let's celebrate and let's send love and light everywhere we go. Also, we are celebrating the Islamic New Year, Rosh Hashanah. So happy New Year to all our Muslim friends. Remember, in life, I have a very, very personal friend, wonderful friend who always says, all in one, one in all, we all are one. Isn't that the truth? So let's practice this. You know the God has a rainbow of colors. Everybody plays a beautiful role. How boring if we would be all black, all white, or it's all such a beautiful rainbow. So let's embrace our difference. 
The moon will travel in the signs of Leo, Virgo and Libra, so it will give that special charm to those people. Virgo, Virgo, happy birthday to you. We love you because you're a perfectionist and you are born to serve and you're always doing a good job. We love you and you smell good too, by the way. Planet smile at you this week. It's your last week to celebrate, so go for it. The new moon and Venus entering your sun also brings charm, power, high energy, creativity, and the ability to get things done. Boom, for you and others. A money situation turns in your favor, a good time for healing, taking care of your health, therapy, and maybe a new hobby to, you know, to inspire your life. On the weekend, happiness awaits in personal life. Wow, it's delicious. Your magical color turquoise lucky numbers, eight and 44. ta -da! Libra, the new moon and Venus, your ruler in your spiritual house brings new possibilities. You can see clearly now. You know the song? I could see clearly now, the rain is gone. That's for you. The focus is on work accomplishments, taking good care of your health looking good time to also tear down to rebuild and really really make your life the way you want it people find you quite attractive and a little flirting could definitely be a lot of fun nothing wrong with that if you're married well you could look but you can touch especially on the weekend and now let's go your magical color is lilac lilac and your lucky numbers are three and nine Scorpio, you feel invincible and can handle anything this week. You are on the go now. Everything is going fast, but you are navigating it very well. The new moon and Venus in your karmic house brings exciting new possibilities in beauty, wellness, health, love, and career. And at work, be ready for a new perspective, a new way, new ideas. Friends also could be visiting you or getting in touch with you, and it will be warm to your heart on the weekend. Romance may offer you an offer you cannot mm -mm, refuse. Your magical color fuchsia lucky numbers 4 and 22. And now Sagittarius, well, the new moon and Venus in your career house brings you more information about your career aspirations and maybe some things will unblock. Maybe you'll receive that text or email or phone call you were waiting for. You discover the true intentions in the love department that helps you make a decision this week in career. Trust your hunches. You will finalize a deal and make a decision. And listen to the advice of a Gemini, a Cancer, or a Virgo. And on the weekend, your sex appeal is really strong. And you feel wanted. And hey, I enjoy it. Wow, just flirt back. Your magical color red, lucky numbers 11 and 23. Capricorn, the new moon and Venus in your karmic house makes you feel confident, more at peace, totally invincible. Everything goes your way. Goodbye past, welcome a brand new life. A concern about a child is solved and the emphasis is falling in love, closing a deal, freedom of action, feeling good and confident and on the weekend celebrate your victory in a, with a special someone or many special someones. Your magical color silver like number 6 and 33. Aquarius, the new moon and Venus in your shared resources house bring answers to many, many questions about your love life, your personal life and your place in your love relationship. And try to see if you're really having a good deal. If you don't, you know, make the adjustment. If you're the giver and the other one is just taking or the other way around, you are the, the taker and the other one is just giving. I mean, you gotta, you gotta do something. That's not love, that's like a deal. So you want to get out of the deal and go back to love with somebody else. In career, you get special attentions from the powers that be. Take action, success await, and on the weekend, your intuition is high, and you better understand the purpose of your life, and you're able now to make some move. Romance also favor, express your feelings. Your magical color, lilac, your, your lucky numbers, two and 25. Pisces, the new moon and Venus in your relationship house helps you to discover who you really are and what you really want. Deep. Deep feelings are very strong, so dig deep to find out what's going on inside. Somehow the unknown is fascinating. You also uh, starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel when it comes to your career and project you started in the beginning of the year. Now you're seeing what's happening and it's good. Gemini Cancer, Pisces also care. And somehow at the end the weekend, Venus and Planets in general will sort of put you on a pedestal. Isn't that beautiful? Your magical color, blue, lucky numbers, 9 and 36. Aries, the new moon and Venus in your 
workhouse brings confidence, a desire for intimacy. Some issues about family may need attention, so take care of it. Kids also bring you luck. In your career, you're able to see the truth and make good contacts, correct mistakes, especially in your traveling situation. You could maybe there were some bad moves there in career or some of the plans. Anyways, you could rectify it this week. You also recover a lost article or find something that you didn't know where it was. And Virgo Taurus gave you a hand. On the weekend, somehow love will make you a surprise. Very pleasant. Your magical color orange, lucky numbers four and 44. Taurus, the new moon and Venus, your ruler in your romantic house, brings good fortune, charm, and the power to convince everyone. And you're so sexy. Expect to make love all week. People will want to make love all week. And if you're married, wow, it would be great. And if you're single, it will be great too. Go for it. Financial picture brighter and brighter. Money comes in and you get great results in all the initiatives you took in projects. You are delighted. On the weekend, celebrate with a loved one. Do something special romantically. A cancer inspires you. And another Taurus or a Virgo could give you a hand. On the weekend also, yoga, meditation, making love, all favored. Your magical color, green, lucky number, 6 and 45. Gemini's, you are in good, good, good cycle now. The new moon and Venus entering your home sector brings blessings and a chance to make things right in love, in personal life, in career. You're getting more enlightened of what is the right thing to do. You feel closer also to your family and friends. Someone important could invite you at a weekend party or maybe to dine out and you should say yes. Shared resources, insurance, legal affairs, politics, all favored and on the weekend, love will smile at you. Please smile back. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers, three and 52. Cancer, Cancer, your rule of the beautiful new moon and Venus planet of love entering your communication sector brings you a sense of adventure, of magic. This week, you will be walking on the wild side. Yes, and it will feel good. Time to think big, dream majestic, take charge and push on your dreams. In love, true, true magic and bliss await. In career, positive people surround you. So, like, listen to what they have to say or the proposals they make you. A special relationship also with an extraordinary friend enriches your life this week. Are you planning a trip? You should go ahead. It will be a lot of fun. And on the weekend, singles or married, Cupid has a surprise for you. Wow, you will be a happy little crabsy. You're gonna walk hand in hand on the beach somewhere or in the forest and you will kissy kissy, huggy huggy. Your magical color pink lucky like numbers 10, 10 and 20. Play lottery. Leo, this is a week to use your wisdom and charm my beautiful, your highness. The new moon and Venus planet of love entering your financial sector brings a strong desire for complete perfection in your life to be the boss of everything. It's all about reaching a good balance between giving and receiving, getting a fair deal in all your relationships. In career, a major opportunity could knock at your door. It's there, it's on the way, so pay attention. And remember, it's your turn to receive. Ask and you shall receive. If you're not getting enough money for what you do, well, sorry, knock, knock, I want more and you'll get it. In love, tenderness, magic, sweetness, somehow knocks at your door so surrender because bliss awaits and you will definitely like that feeling of tenderness all weekend long enjoy it you deserve it taurus pisces and cancer care your magical color gold lucky numbers 5 and 41. and now here's your wizard affirmation of this fabulous week of the beautiful new moon and remember when there's a new moon it's new beginnings make a wish who we are is not our thoughts. Who we really are is our feelings. Love is who we are. Our heart is who we are. And love, 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 love is the only thing that matters. Everything, everything else comes and goes, but love is in the beginning. It is now. It is tomorrow. It is everywhere for everyone. Isn't that marvelous? Mm. I love you guys. Love, 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 love you guys.